As restrictions start to ease up around the nation, more people are starting to travel again. At Orlando International Airport, between October 10th and the 17th, nearly 230,000 people were screened at security checkpoints. New 6's Etsy Castro is at the airport and spoke to travelers about the uptick. Orlando International Airport seeing its busiest week since March, since the pandemic began. Just on Sunday, TSA screened about 36,000 passengers. We've been homebound all summer, um, just trying to do the safety thing. Jen Morgan and her son Hudson live in Colorado and just wrapped up his birthday trip here in Orlando. They tell us this is the first time they've traveled in seven months adding that they are way more comfortable traveling now. And Orlando was their first pick. When we left Denver, we saw um, a huge increase. That's the busiest that I've seen the airport um, since we left. So yeah, I'm hopeful that this is just kind of the beginning of starting to get things back to normal again. Just like the Morgans, thousands of more passengers have traveled out of OIA this month. In fact, the Greater Orlando Aviation Authority says TSA agents screened over 29,000 passengers on Saturday and 36,000 on Sunday, making it the busiest day at the airport since March 17. And with the holidays just around the corner, Shane Campfield believes more travelers could boost tourism and our local economy. Places like Disney, Universal and the airport are really desperate for um, for increase in funds and all that. So I would say um, it's pretty much the best of both worlds. At Orlando International Airport, Ezzy Castro getting results, News 6.